about uh, giving the cows a bale. They're still out in the north end. This is the little road field. It's uh, nine acres in here. So that's just taking the Massey down. It's got a half bale. It's, uh, I think when I finished the 20 acres, I couldn't make a full bale, so I think it's the last of that. But uh, that's just what I've been feeding them. Is a few bales that uh, strings didn't tie properly in the baler. Out of 380 bales, I think I had five that the strings either went on only part way or not at all. And two or three times it was a shear pin that had broke and I wasn't paying attention and then I kicked the bale out. And then when it fell on the ground, I'm like, oh, that's got no strings on it. And the other two or three times, whatever the difference, uh, it was uh, because the twine arms, the twine had broke off. It wasn't cutting properly on the knife, so it more like broke off, pulled apart, uh, and uh, snapped. And then when it snapped, it wasn't long enough for the bale to grab it. So... Uh, anyways, we're just feeding the cows. They're out here on the pasture. We've had some pretty good snow in the last couple days. So, just giving them a half bale because if they come back to the south pasture uh, where we feed them during the winter, then I don't have a full bale of waste down here. It's just a half a bale that they'll pick through anyways today and probably tomorrow because probably not going to move them today or tomorrow. So... The water's still not bad down here. It's slushy this morning in the trough, so just clean the slush out, try and keep it from icing over. And uh, as long as the water stays open, I'll feed them down here because it keeps the mess down here. I see Dad's having some trouble with that door. Must have to move the latch over a little bit. I have trouble with it the other day. It popped open on me. So... Just simply chuck it over the fence. We probably should be using a ring feeder down here, but this is probably going on five, six bales, which I didn't realize we'd be feeding them this much down here. So I never moved one of the ring feeders. Oh, he must be wanting me to get out and cut the strings. So yeah, there's the bale. It's just a little half bale, three footer or something. Toss it in there. There is some waste going on because, like I say, there's no ring feeder down here, and there should be, but uh, by the time I get a ring feeder down here now, there'll be time to move them home, so they can pick through it as much as they can, and then uh, I, there'll be a little bit of compost, I guess. It's expensive compost, but what else do you do? trying to set it flat. It must be uneven where he is. He's got her now. So I got some grain. We'll grain them, mix some mineral in with it, help them out a little bit here with the snow. So that's pretty much it. Just feeding the cows a bale. <laughs> 